You're watching News 19 Daybreak with Dustin Lukey and meteorologist Alyssa Triplett. Daybreak continues right now. Good morning, welcome back. We're cooking up something that puts the fun in fundraiser, especially for any barbecue fan. It's called the Holy Smoke Dinner, and it's a senior exit project for Justin Kettner. And uh, Chris Peterson is his mentor on the project. Justin, Chris, thanks for being with us this morning. Thanks for having yeah, me on. Thank you. Yeah, we're glad to have you to talk about this. Uh, uh, so it's a senior exit project at yes. West Salem. We've talked about these before. Uh, people who, who've watched News 19 for a while have seen that. You know, we, we sometimes highlight some of these projects, and they, they are such great projects. Yours is particularly fun, a barbecue dinner. Yes. Where does this idea come from? What does it so, all entail? So I've always really enjoyed cooking, and then I also wanted to give back to my community, so I thought, what was a way I could do this? It was like a fundraiser dinner, and then I was talking with my dad, and he knew Chris, who does a lot of barbecue, and I enjoy, I think everyone enjoys eating barbecue. <laughs> right. I thought I could maybe put both of them together, so I get, we talked with Chris, and he was willing to help me out with planning a fundraiser, and the barbecue and teaching me all of that kind of stuff. Yeah, so the barbecue itself, I think, is coming up on February 1st. February 1st. Correct? It's a Saturday, 5 to 7 p.m. at the West Salem High School. Uh, and who's it open to? Everybody. Everybody. Anybody and anyone who wants to come and support. Come and support. Enjoy some good barbecue. Good bar uh, what is the money going toward then? The nu nutrition program at West Salem. Sure. So any of the lunches that weren't able to be paid off or have negative accounts, it's going to go and help offset those. What a great cause. So uh, eating some good food for uh, the purpose of helping others eat good food good as food well. Good food for a good cause. Exactly. Yeah. I love that. And Chris, what was it like working with this young man? Well, <clears throat> Justin found out early that if we're going to do it, we're going to start from <laughs> ground zero. We talked about wood and types of wood and myths of barbecue way back in September. And we had sample runs of sauces and the science of salt. Remember yes. that day? And oh, wow. We're recording things <laughs> and... Uh, and, and cooking and, um, and and the neat part is is that we're learning about barbecue but we're learning about giving back so it's kind of a two-part project the food part is kind of the easy part it's yes. the fundraiser and putting together these big projects that a lot All of those planning. great planning yeah. lessons and and things that he'll carry through you know our, our mantra is if we can do it today let's do, do it. it today don't wait yes. till tomorrow so it'll be a fun fun project come on out and we have some music you yes up we some do music we got a couple, a uh, few local artists that volunteer oh, to donate their time and come play. Very cool. So again, mark your calendars for February 1st uh, at West Salem High School. Correct. 5 to 7. 5 to 7 p.m. Have some good barbecue. And it sounds like, yeah. again, uh, not just your, you know, you're not just throwing anything on the grill here. You've gone in depth with the barbecue. Yeah. Real, real. <laughs> sauces, homemade sauces, homemade Ooh. rubs, pulled pork, 190 pounds. Oh, yeah. all great Our goal stuff. is to reach what? Your goal is $3,000? 3, $3,000 donations, hopefully. Great food for a great cause. February 1st. Justin, Chris, thanks for being with us Thank to share so the much. details. Thank we'll you. have those as well on our website, WXW.com. Alyssa, over to you. Well, thanks, Dustin. And after the break, we're continuing to see that snowfall. But when is it going to stop? We'll have the details.